real quick before we go ahead and get into this video i would just like to let you guys know that i actually currently am gifting my subscribers and if you guys would like to go ahead and get a gift from the fortnite item shop or the fortnite chapter 2 season 8 battle pass all you have to go in and do is make sure that you're subscribing with all notifications on and then of course coming back for every single video and commenting down your epic games i'm gonna do my best to gift the first couple people to every single video so make sure that you're one of the first people and with that being said let's go ahead and continue on with this video Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Aiden and welcome back to yet another Fortnite video here in the channel. I'm gonna be honest, I had no idea that the Cube Queen skin was actually going to be releasing today. I think that's absolutely dumb because they always release secret skins on Thursdays. So to be honest, this skin came out like four or five hours ago and I was actually asleep. So that kind of stinks. It looks like I gotta go ahead and make a video on it now. But guys, if you don't know, the brand new quests have actually came out to actually unlock all of the Cube Queen and her extra styles. And these quests are actually insanely easy to go ahead and do and in this video i'm going to be going over every single one of them and how you guys can actually go ahead and complete them as fast as possible a lot of them are super straightforward so i don't feel like i have to actually hop in a game and show you how to do it but the ones that aren't straightforward don't worry i got you guys but yeah before i get into these quests consider leaving a like on this video sharing with some friends of course subscribing if you are brand new for even more fortnite content just like this with that being said let's go ahead and get straight into these quests because it shouldn't take very long to explain now as you guys can see the first First quest right here is actually survive storm circles while carrying a sideways weapon. What I recommend doing is actually landing at one of these sideways zones and just going ahead and getting a sideways minigun because that is the best weapon. Plus, there's going to be a quest later on that actually has to deal with that minigun. And just surviving five storm circles. A storm circle is basically every single time that the zone actually comes in. So basically, every single new zone, you'll actually go ahead and get one fifth of this quest completed. So yeah, this one's super easy. Just make sure you have like the sideways minigun because you'll need it for a different quest and i believe that quest is actually coming up next with eliminate a player with the sideways minigun this is probably going to be insanely easy because the sideways minigun is super easy to go ahead and use and it's super overpowered as well so yeah that's how you guys can actually go ahead and get this emoticon right here to be honest it's a pretty cool looking emoticon but that being said the next quest is actually just shake down opponents just play like duos or squads or whatever and you should be able to go ahead and get this loading screen pretty easily this is called the queen's core and it's pretty sick honestly i'm gonna go ahead and put it full screen real quick because oh my god yeah that is pretty cool let's go ahead and back out and go ahead and move on to the next quest which is actually oh this is absolutely insane holy crap okay that's really cool so this one is just use a shadow stone or flopper to phase for three seconds near a player so honestly that one's pretty easy as well i would go ahead and just land one of the zones with the shadow stones and just go ahead and stay by players and just like you know phase near them super easy to go ahead and do you should be able to go ahead and do this pretty fast especially because i think it also picks up for when other people are in the little shadow stone phase mode so basically they won't be able to damage you and you won't be able to damage them as long as you're just phasing near each other you should be good to go it looks like the final thing to actually go ahead and unlock the first style for the cube queen which is this black and style right here it's actually just completing all of the previous four quests so that's actually really easy to go ahead and unlock this style I don't know why the cube queen is just such a simple thing to go ahead and unlock this year. I don't know why. But moving on to the next page, it looks like you actually have to go ahead and just complete five quests to actually go ahead and unlock this page. So let's go ahead and do that and I'll come back to you guys with these quests. Be right back. Okay, so because I want to get this video out as soon as possible for you guys so I can give you a in-depth guide on how to go over all of the Storm Queen skins, here is actually page two. Now, page two, the first quest is actually just deal damage to players with the sideways scythe, which will actually unlock you the reality render pickaxe, which I'll go ahead and actually show you guys what exactly that is right now as we're going over this. That is actually going to be this pickaxe right here, which is really, really cool. Now, the next quest is actually going to be complete a bounty from the bounty board and you only have to complete one bounty and that'll actually go ahead and unlock you this spray which i mean it's just a spray but it is pretty cool i kind of like the light blue i think that looks pretty interesting after that guys we have get player headshots with the sideways rifle which will actually go ahead and unlock you this music right here which is some pretty good music i went ahead and listened to it before making this video and this part of this video so yeah i do kind of like it i think it's pretty interesting after that guys the next quest is actually 
actually glide in some smoke stacks at steamy stacks and that'll actually go ahead and unlock you this really sick looking glider i mean look at how cool this glider is it's like she's like walking down honestly this is the, probably the coolest glider in the entire game look at how sick that is i literally can't get over how cool it is it's honestly probably one of the best things i've ever seen and of course guys the final quest is actually just completing all of the cube queen quests on page two so technically you only have to complete eight quests in order to unlock all of the styles i mean honestly this style isn't the best style but it's pretty cool it's gold it looks animated and yeah it is pretty interesting so because none of these quests are genuinely complicated i'm not gonna hop into a game and actually go over every single one of them with you but if you guys want individual guides let me know down in the comment section below and i would be happy to actually send you links to all of my unlisted videos going over every single one of those because that's actually what i'm going to be recording next before you do leave this video consider leaving a like on this video sharing it with some friends and of course subscribing if you are brand new for even more fortnite content just like this with that being said i'm gonna go ahead and get straight into making even more content for you guys because there's a ton of stuff that actually came in within this update so expect like two more videos going out later today peace